Currency okay, cool. accuracy. What am I missing? Um, the username or the the yeah the URL. What 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 should it be? Um, not your broker's name, just um homes by Eli or something like that. Cause that link, what we're gonna eventually do is get your own dot com. So that could be you know your own dot com, but 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 internally every page that you create, that's gonna be the URL homes by Eli dot Carter dot com. Okay. So that name follows follows every page. So you want that to be a name you'll be with forever. Perfect. Jeez. Okay, you found like yeah, you don't need that one. Okay, hang on. It's like a salesy message. Okay, so scroll down, scroll down, see if you Several can. Emails, but you want to find one subject, your car traverse login. Watch this video for anything else. I'm sure you'll walk me through it. Oh, yeah, dude. So do you have to scroll? So did you get a confirmation email or anything? So let's see. Yeah, I did. There we go. Oh, perfect. Okay, cool. So then. Yeah, bookmark this login page. This one? Um, that was actually, I think it was on the other email, but that is your username. That's your, your password. You can always change your password. <laughs> Why is that my uh, password? I just set my password. <laughs> Sign up. <laughs> did you I just, did, you did I set it? I just chose one and they're like, here's your password. I'm like, okay. So let's see which one it, what it, which one it is. Go back to the other email because the other email had your login, the login link. Thank you, page here uh... there you go so bookmark this page this is this is where you'll be at um to log in and then let, let's see which password okay my password worked Just perfect there. okay so okay cool so brand you could just um yeah you can x out of that one okay i watched the video okay so in here you can just x out of all that or hit the green button, let the Kartra experience begin. Okay, cool. So in here to the left, all you're going to really focus on is my communications, my pages, my forms, and my calendars. That's really all there is to it. Like the calendar, that link, you'll, you'll set up a whole calendar in here. That calendar link will end up going on any thank you page is what I recommend. I mean, if, if I'm, if I'm, you know, running Facebook ads and I'm taking them to a landing page, whether I'm promoting a listing an open house, or I'm giving away a buyer or seller guide, that's the landing page. And when they fill out the form name, email, they click submit, they go to a thank you page. Since you're a realtor and we're looking for freaking deals, what you're going to want to do is on that thank you page. That's where a link goes to your calendar. And what I would also do, and here's what you're going to do for sure. I want you to really do this is on that. Thank you page. It's a short video of you. So, so always remember there's your landing page and then there's your thank you page on that. Thank you page video of Eli. So if we're, if we're running an ad to a landing page for a listing, they opt in, they go to a thank you page. It's a 30 second video of you. Hey guys, thank you so much for opting in. Let me tell you a little bit more about this property, but first let me introduce myself, right? It's a simple video of you introducing yourself talking about the property, giving a little bit more specs, and then having a call to action. This is on the thank you page. On the call to, the call to action on that thank you page is to click the button below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule a, you know, your best time. So I'll always try to put that calendar link on the thank you page of anything that I'm promoting and in the emails that are going to follow. Because if you're opting in, for a listing, or if you're opting in and you're seeing my Facebook ad for an open house, or if you're opting in and I'm giving away a buyer or seller guide, there's going to be a handful of emails that follow. And, and that's in my communications to the left. So that's your email autoresponder. So in these emails, I'll always have a link to my calendar. Hey, John, just wanted to follow up. I know yesterday you inquired on 777 Plaza Boulevard. Let me tell you a little bit more about it. Hey, and by the way, click the link below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your best time. Can't wait to talk to you, John. And these are automated uh, emails with, with a link to your calendar. What system do you use to embed video into the email so it plays right away? Very, very good question. 
you can't. There's not too many softwares where, where it actually plays in. In fact, I don't think there's any software that, that the video actually plays in the email. What you have to set up and what everyone sets up and what I set up is an image. So in the email, there's an image. And when they click on the image, then they're taken to a, a, a second page, which we'll have to set up, which is simple. It's another, another page. And on that page is your video. I have a million of those. So it's either I'm going to send out an email. There's an image. You're going to click on it. It's going to take you to another Kartra page where there's only a video. Or I can have that email, put an image, and when they click on the image, then I take them to my YouTube video. So it just depends on how you want to do it. If you want to, I mean, what, what could be Got good it. for you? I mean, it, 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 I, would, I, would do, I, would, I would put them on a page. Like, I can show you mine. I have a million of them. So when I send you an email, in fact, I don't know if you're on any of my email lists, but when I send out an email, there's an image, and it's a video, so I'm promoting a video. You click on the image, it takes you to another Kartra page where there's my video. And the reason why I do it that way and not have you click on the image and take you straight to YouTube the reason why I take you straight from the email, clicking on the image straight to another Kartra page is so I can Facebook pixel you. Got it. And, and, and so now what we got to do and what I wanted to spend time with you on is setting up custom audiences. We want to set up custom audiences around all these pages. So as we start to build pages, I need a custom audience who's landing on my landing page. I need a custom audience of who's landing on my thank you page. And so these custom audiences are very, very important. And then, and then setting up custom conversions is very, very important as well. Okay. Um, so we now have the account. It just comes down to what's our, what's our, and, and here's, a, here's, here's what I mentioned our, on our first call. Your very next ad, your very first ad, our very next ad here should be the intro. It should be an intro. And in that case, you're not going to need a landing page this, this moment. Um, because the whole strategy with an intro video is to simply run it under video views and get thousands of people to see it. So we can then turn that into a custom audience and then retarget them with Facebook ad number two under conversions. And by that time, we'll have our landing pages set up. So, so where people mess up is when they run an ad on a listing or an open house and they do it under video views, they'll run an ad once and that's it. And it's like, dude, you got to now have the whole purpose of running video views. It's not to capture leads. The whole purpose of running video views is to capture a custom audience. So then we can turn around and, and keep showing these people our future ads. So if you can run a video ad, what I would do is I would literally put, let's just say, I mean, you, you don't have to put no more than a hundred bucks. Even if you spent 50 bucks, like if you spent 50 bucks over the next few days and ran an intro video of you, you'd get a few thousand people to see it. If you, if you spend a hundred bucks, which here's what I really, really recommend. I recommend you running an intro video all damn month. Like you said it at five bucks a day, you run it for 30 days. And, and to tell you the truth, I would leave that ad on to tell you the truth. Because as that ad runs, all we're doing is retargeting the people who are watching it with future ads. And that's powerful, man. That's powerful. You like. What, what do you want to be in the intro video? Like what's kind of the verb? Dude, just like your first one, bro, like a couple years ago, you, your background, your experience. Remember the one you and Becca did? Just yeah. like that. Like introduce yourself as the newest Compass freaking top freaking agent. Like you're there at Compass not ready to crush it and freaking kick ass. Let, let, let the audience know who you are. Let them know who your new broker is and why you chose Compass. Let them know you've been in the business for a while and, and now you found a home. Here's why, why, and why. And, and here's why I'm so fired up. And here's why I'm so optimistic on our industry. Here's where I see our city headed as far as real estate is concerned. Just your background, your experience, exactly what you did in the first one. And so what we didn't do on the first one is we didn't create a custom audience to then retarget with ad number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like we didn't do that part. Now, we if you remember just, the, the video view ads, uh, they were like all over the world. They're like, we no, no, no. The like ad was the like ad was oh, okay. the, the, the videos that the, it, every ad from this point on is targeted. It's just targeted your local backyard. The like ad, that's where you target everyone. But now from this point on, no, hell no. We're only targeting a specific area and I need thousands of people in that area to see who the hell I am. And, and, and just by warming them up with an intro is, is a good way to do it. Now, again, the whole purpose of that is to create a custom audience. 
uh, just FYI, here's a bomb bomb. Let's you embed into the the body of the email. Okay. And it shows you how long it is. Do you think that's useful or like, is there a different way to do this? I mean, yeah. it it is, but bomb bomb. How much are we paying for this now? Fifty bucks a month. Okay. And it's just email. It's like so. It, it allows you to record. So right here, you click on this little extension. Mm-hmm. Uh, let me. So here, so. so it, so screen record, right? Or I can uh, camera record right here, mm -hmm. launch recorder. So I can record myself on my phone or here. And then uh, the beauty of it that I can, um, like they can click it right here. They can have a little preview of me and then they can watch it within the email. And also it um, has like tracking who opened my video, how many times they watched it and stuff like that. So is that worth 50 bucks or? No, I don't think it is because I'd rather spend that 50 bucks on retargeting you with Facebook ads. That video, I could be seeing that in, in the newsfeed. Okay. Like I really could. And, and, and if I really wanted to go the extra step, I can still have that in my email autoresponder with Kartra anyways. So okay. spending 50 bucks for that, and then you're going to spend another 100 bucks for landing pages only. And then you're going to need some calendar software, which a lot of people try to use Calendly, which is free until you, until you need an upgrade. And then it's like, 25 bucks a month so rather than having all these multiple services i just want to use one um and then and then any any excess budget goes straight into the facebook ad um and and again with that that's what i do i do those videos but it's just not it's not and and here's the thing here's the thing with bomb bomb from what i'm seeing right now it's super clear to me okay i send them that email they watch that video and now i know who watched it but what does that do for me? Like that doesn't, that doesn't do anything for me. The reason why I'd rather have that, I'd rather, I'd rather have them click on it and go to one single page where they can watch that video. The only reason why I'd rather do that is so I can Facebook pixel them. Because right now with your data through BombBomb, we'd have to exclude that. I mean, we'd have to maybe take that, download that info and then upload it to Facebook to create a custom audience of everyone who's watching it which is more steps than, than necessary. Because all I gotta do is Facebook pixel you. I send you an email, you click on the image, you're taken to a second page where I have my pixel tracking you. And, and that page, I'm building a custom audience around. So I don't think it's worth it at all. I don't think it's worth it at all, at all, at all, at all, at all. Good, Good. I gotta save some money. <laughs> yeah, for sure, bro, that's, that's not needed at all. Cause I'll show you to do that with just this simple email alone. But again, the, the, the reason why it's better is so we can Facebook pixel everybody. It's all about pixeling. Every page needs to be pixeled because that gives me data and that allows me to create custom audiences of who's watching my stuff. So for example, that email goes out. Rather than the video playing in the email, they see an image and it looks just like a video because it's, 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 a, it's a screenshot. So they click on the image thinking that they're about to play a video. It takes them to the second page and then, and then I'm, and then I'm pixeling you actually, damn, I think this is going to, I think we might get cut off pretty soon. If we do, then just, um, then just, um, log back in, Okay. but, but, but now I'm able, I'm able to pixel you and now I can run a Facebook ad to everyone who opened my email. I can literally label that in Facebook. These are all people who watched my email and then I can run an ad just to them. Hey, John, or not John, I wouldn't call him out by name, but I'd say, hey guys, this is David. I noticed you've been watching my emails. I noticed you've been seeing my videos via email. I just wanted to kind of give you an update. Like literally you can start calling people out like that all because you built a custom audience around everyone who was watching your shit. Only because you took them to a page that you Facebook pixeled. I couldn't do that if that video was playing in my email. Does that, that make sense? sense. Yeah, I mean, you you got to get into that landing page, and you have. All I got to get you to a page, text. man. I got to get you a pa to a page, because right. I got to pixel that. I I need that data, I need that data for Facebook ads. So the less we can spend on all these other fancy whistles and and, and all this bells and bells and whistles, like, then then the better, then the more you'll have for Facebook advertising, which which all that that's the that's the only thing that matters. So now I can start talking to my to my to to these audiences a certain way. I can run one ad to everyone who opened my email. Hey guys, I know you've been following me via email. First of all, thank you so much. Let me give you an update on what's going on. And now we're only talking to the email people. That's a Facebook through a Facebook ad. You know, so that that's what's that's what's super super powerful is is these custom audiences. <coughs> so, 
That's just, why. Uh, Go ahead. Oh, uh, sorry. Before before we jump into actually setting stuff up, uh, I wrote down just kind of want to read off the list here, like different ideas for content as Perfect. I do videos, right? Um, so like each thirty days, once a month, like how's the market? Kind of like just what's sold, what what's listed, kind of what's going on, mm -hmm. if it's going up or down. Um, things like you know five mis five biggest mistakes to avoid, or like you know top five things that someone does to do this in their home, or something like that. Mm. Uh, like the top three things you need to know when selling your home in winter, you know, like something, yes, some dude. random yes. stuff. So, um, the behind the scenes stuff, of course, like when I have a stager or contractor over or something like that, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. like any, any other things, I mean, that's kind of what, you know, <clears throat> what it is right now. Those are perfect, man. And just remember at the end of every video, there's a call to action and the call to action is to click, learn more. And I'm just, I, I can't stress it enough how simple and how easy it is to capture lead by giving them a PDF. Like we have to implement that. Like we have to get a hold of a seller guide. I got a ton of seller guides I can throw your way and just, you'll have to just get them redone. But I mean, that, that's not going to cost a lot at all. Do you ever use Fiverr? You ever heard of Fiverr? Oh, I love Fiverr. Oh dude, I love Fiverr too, bro. I can give you some seller guides and just freaking send them to one of those guys and say, Hey dude, here's 15 bucks. I need you to rebrand this shit. Put my face, put my information, make it look like my shit. Right. They'll do that for 15, 20 bucks. Nice. You know, and, and so that becomes your bait. So as we're doing these videos on the process of selling, hey guys, thank you so much for joining me. And hey, by the way, click the learn more button. It'll take you straight to my page where you can download your free 2020 seller guide that's going to cover this, this, and this, and this. Don't forget to click learn more. See you on our next video. So now, now there's a call to action. And, and again, that person goes to the page. They opt in because now you're giving them something of value. And now I got that lead. And through that email automation, which is to the left, my communications, through that email automation, that's where I'm going to continue to build the relationship. I'm going to know exactly who's on these lists. So therefore, I can create custom audiences and continue to retarget them with more future ads. And, and in the email, again, as I mentioned on our first call, it makes our emails, it makes it, e it makes it even easier to even write these emails because now these next 10 emails that we set up after the fact after they opt in, these next 10 emails that are going to follow are all about the book. So, so, so that's why we need something to talk about in these emails. You're not going to just talk about a bunch of random shit. Like, let's keep it on topic. You came to my page because you downloaded a, sell, downloaded a seller guide. You came to my page because you saw me on video talking about a buyer guide or talking about the process of buying. So these are solid leads, man. Like, why in the hell would you download my buyer guide if you had absolutely no interest in buying? Mm -hmm. Right. Who the hell would even do that? So, so it just makes my email content more easier to write because now I'm going to be talking about what they did. Hey, John, I know nine days ago you freaking downloaded my buyer guide. Hey, do you remember on page seven when I was talking about making sure you speak to a lender first? Here's what I meant by it. Hey, and by the way, click the link below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your best time. Can't wait to talk to you, John. And that's email number nine that went out 18 days later. Right. So, so, that, that, that's a simple cookie cutter strategy that you can easily implement and, and, and keep things fresh and fun and, and on topic and, and, and educate people. All we're trying to do here is nurture the list and educate people on the process of buying or the process of selling. It's not really about creating content on how badass you are. Everybody knows you're badass, but we need to educate. So this content, those are great topics. It gives you the ability to educate and give away something based on that education. Make okay. sense? That makes sense, yeah. So rather than just pitch, 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 I'm going to educate, 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 and win you over that way. So let's say, let's say I go into the office or wherever I record a video from the recording being done to actually people getting it. Like, how does it all set up? Like, is, do I put that email right away or is it like the two weeks from now kind of email in the drips? Well, if I, if I saw your Facebook ad today, if I saw that video today, I click on it. There, there, again, there has to be something that you're giving me. I'm not going to just, and that's why the download is so damn important because as a consumer, why in the hell am I giving you, I mean. Oh, so I meant, I meant the, the, so the, so the videos I record, those are the ads that go up right away. So people yes. click on that, go to the landing pages, but the videos inside the landing pages for the action, those are just pre-recorded all the time the same, right? They could be for sure. For sure. They could be for sure. For sure. Like, for example, in my case, I have a download, I have a PDF, I have a, what I call a book, an ebook, right? You download my ebook 
you should hack me and, and look at my process. Because all I do is I, I take you to my landing page. And then once you opt in, you go to my thank you page all where right. it's me Where's on I video. Go? Where do I go for you? Go to, um, go to the social real estate agent.com. All one word. The social real estate agent.com. Actually, it's going to be, it's going to be that one, but I'm going to send you to the actual free, the free download. Actually, no, not the social agent, the social real estate agent.com. The social real estate agent.com forward slash free book. And look, I even have, yeah, not book, free book. I even have a little countdown clock on it. So I'm giving you something away. I'm giving away something for free and I'm even creating urgency. If you scroll down, you'll see a little countdown clock. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, dude, this is all Kartra, bro. So send me the book, click on the blue button, and then it's going to take you to a thank you page where it's me on video. I'm saying thank you. I'm introducing myself and I'm telling you to click the button below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can book a strategy call. This is nice. Let's see. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for downloading your copy of the social real estate agent. Five steps to implement on social media to capture more leads and build your personal brand fast. You guys, my name is David Cantero, author of the social real so estate agent. I just go into that whole spill and get you to schedule a call. And so when you click that button, it takes you straight to my calendar. But for those that don't do that, because there's going to be an X amount that don't click the button and schedule a call, that's when you're going to receive my emails. So over the next few days, watch, you're going to, you're going to experience my whole flow. Over the next few days, I have emails that are going out. And when you click on that email, it's a video. So what I'm doing over the next few days is I'm talking about the book. So all I'm doing is I'm getting you indoctrinated with my video. That's all video is, bro. That's the power of a Facebook video ad is that as people continue to see your freaking mug, they become indoctrinated and glued to you without them even freaking knowing. Mm -hmm. Like that's the power of video. So through my, through my emails, email number one is going to come out tomorrow. And all I'm doing is talking about that book and I'm doing it via, via video. So when you open up my email, you're going to click on the link. It's going to go to another page where it's me on video. So I'm not, so my video is not in the email. My video is on a page, but on that page, I'm Facebook pixeling you. Mm -hmm. So now I can go around, turn around and run a next, run another ad to everyone who opened up that email. Cause now I have the data from the pixel. Got so it. I can run a specific ad to everyone who just downloaded my book. And so that's what you'd be doing. So, so in these emails that start to go out, you want to talk about that book, educate them on the book. Hey, John, page 10,